Good morning, fourth graders. You know what time it is, and we have something exciting for today. It's time for our chick check-in. Today is a good day. And it's an exciting day because today starts our chick's journey to hatching. By Friday or Saturday, we'll have baby chicks. Okay, so let's look. On day 18, which was May 19th, the um, chick is preparing to hatch. The remaining yolk is absorbed through its navel. It's kind of interesting. Navel is a fancy word for belly button. And then today, May 20th, we bring them out of the egg turner and the beak pips into the air cell and the chick begins to breathe. Which means today is the first day that we could possibly hear our chicks pipping or peeping. Peep, peep, peep. I can't hear it yet. So, to get them out of the egg turner, we are going to just move them into the egg carton, and then I'll remove the egg turner. I also need to fill up the water and get the humidity to 65 to 75%. Now, if you remember, before we had it, and it was anywhere between 45 and 55, so we're really pushing that up. They need a lot of humidity when they hatch and um, to come out. Eggs are porous, and porous means that they breathe. So that humidity just kind of helps the egg and helps them um, move it along and helps them get out of that egg. So let's get to removing eggs. All done. Now, what we need to do to raise that humidity is we need to fill, before we had, we only filled one, now we're gonna fill two trays. Get my trusty water. And I'm gonna make sure I have it all the way filled because once I close this, I am not opening this again. All right. We are good. So what happens is I'm going to put the eggs back in. We're going to close that and then that's it. I'll see if I can hear any chirps or peeps.
and that's it. Day 20, embryo becomes a chick officially on day 20 and it starts breathing in the air cell and possibly pipping begins. And then on Friday, so we could, we could have babies anytime from Thursday, Friday is the day they're supposed to hatch, and on into Saturday. <coughs> That's better. So how we're gonna do this is I am just gonna go live on YouTube and stream and try and catch the chicks. Um, I'm just gonna put my phone down on top and try and move it around and then I will have my live feed going. I hope you can tune in. I will email you and email your parents. Um, if we do have one pipping and there is a live stream, if you haven't already, maybe ask your parents if they can set up notifications on their YouTube. Um, you just have to click, so like and subscribe. Of course. But then if you click the little bell uh, on the uh, sub next to subscribe, it will send you an email and send, you and send notifications that we have a live stream going. That's all for today. Next time I see you, maybe we'll have some chips. Bye guys.